The atomic bomb is remembered today as the largest and most destructive bomb dropped during the Second World War. But before the use of the atomic bomb in August of 1945, the largest bomb dropped during the war was called the Earthquake Bomb. Invented by the British for use against heavily fortified targets in occupied Europe, earthquake bombs were designed to land close to targets and penetrate the ground before exploding, creating massive craters that would cause buildings to collapse. Earthquake bombs could also penetrate the targets themselves and saw extensive use against concrete U-boat pens, which regular bombs had failed to destroy. In June 1944, the first 12,000 pound earthquake bombs, called Tall Boys, were introduced. They saw use against tunnels, bridges, U-boat pens, and even Hitler's personal residence. In November 1944, RAF bombers sank the German battleship Tirpitz using Tall Boy bombs. The British would also develop the Grand Slam, a 22,000 pound earthquake bomb, in 1945. Despite the relative success of the earthquake bombs, they're not very well known today, because for most people,